Hey everyone, it's Alyssa from Plan Alyssa, and I am here with a quick video. It is a haul follow-up video. This is a follow-up to um, a haul video I made back in the spring, back in April, and I went to a rummage sale and a couple of thrift stores. Now, I didn't really get that much. The rummage sale, I was pretty disappointed. I got like barely anything at it. Although I sold a number of the things that I picked up, so I guess I did pretty well. And at the thrift stores, I, I didn't get too much, not not much at all, really. In total, I spent uh, $34.25 at, uh, you know, the sale and the two stores all together. Um, now, since that time, I have sold items for a total of $133.76, so um, I guess I did well for my investment. I mean, I didn't spend much, um, made a decent amount. Now, that's not pure profit. That's just gross income from these sales, so, you know, my profit is... Uh, is a little bit smaller than that, but um, I still did pretty well. Sold stuff um, on Etsy and Amazon, I think. Nothing on eBay in this haul. But I will go ahead and show you using uh, clips from the original haul what sold, how much it sold for, and uh, where it sold. I don't think I know the prices on everything that I paid for things. Um, Nothing cost too much money in this haul, so um, none of it was too expensive. But anyway, I will show you where they sold and what they sold for. Uh, so it gives you an idea of what sells, and then I'll put a link at the end of this video and in the description below if you want to watch the full haul video, see all the stuff that I didn't sell, and, uh, you know, maybe pass those items by because those weren't good sellers. Um, but they might still sell. I mean, it hasn't been too, too long, uh, certainly less than a year. Um, you know, that these things have been for sale, some even for less time than, you know, I don't necessarily get things listed right away, even though I bought these things back in April, uh, might not have even gotten listed till over the summer, um, depending on how far behind I was on things. But anyway, uh, gives you an idea of the stuff that sells, but uh, yeah, just a quick haul follow-up video for you. I got, I got this bag, um, vintage vinyl tote bag. My grandmother used to always have a bunch of these. This one's pretty cool. Um, I'm almost tempted to keep it for myself, but I think I'll list it on Etsy. And uh, I got a Tom Tom, a Tom Tom one. I don't know how much value there is, and I think I paid five bucks for it. It does work. I just tested it. it tested it. One vintage handkerchief, uh, flowered. Uh, when I was looking at the handkerchiefs, there was like a box there, and you know there had been one woman going through them, and so she probably picked out anything that was good. And then books. Um, this one is called Ramtha. I don't know. It's that's how it looks. It's very so this, I think it's called something like the White Book or something like that. My Futurist Years by Roman Jacobson. Uh, this one I think was a slow moving one. I got this stationery for a dollar. It's, uh, I don't know if you can see, it's got butterflies and a fairy on it. it it's missing envelopes. It just has the paper. Got one more book. Illustration School, Let's Draw Happy People. Really low sales rank on that one. And my big purchase here is a new in the box Casio calculator. Seven dollars. The box does have some wear to it though, so I might list it as used like new. 